Having a look at my EQ search all list, we can see that I do have quite a few items on this list. I think it is more than about time that I updated my equipment. The first item on this list goes on my eyes and is called Golden Eye Contacts, which can be found in an area called Orlando. The best way to get to Orlando is to run to Orlando from Recall. And the best way to get to Recall is to type Run to Recall. Now we have been to Hotel Orlando a couple of times, but I was a much lower level then. We just need to figure out who has the contacts. iwovart.org is a database for Aardwolf. This is a player maintained database, so it is quite possible that not everything that you need or is in game is listed on here. Let's have a look and see if I can find my golden eye contacts. First, we need to click on equipment at the top of the window. Here we have a listing of all the different equipment slots that are available. Let's click on eye to find our golden eye contact. Excellent, this database has a lot of information. I probably should have come here just a little bit earlier. Scrolling down a little bit, we can see that level 18 here, we have the golden eye contacts. These are found at Hotel Orlando and are on a mob called Mad Bird. All right, let's go back to the game and see if we can find this Mad Bird in Hotel Orlando. Typing where mad, we can see that a mad bird is on a pinnacle. Well, a pinnacle to me looks like it is up. So let's go up and up. Ah, here we are in an attic. Let us open the up direction and go up. All right, we have a mad bird in this room and it has attacked us. If you have a look on my screen, you can probably just make out that you get the golden eye contacts from the mad bird. In fact, I've just gotten another one. And yet another. Fantastic, I've got three golden eye contacts, but only one set of eyes. Maybe I can sell the others. Or donate them for other newbies to use. All right, let's, oh, the door's closed. Let's open this door and get out of here. Excellent, those mad birds were very tough. Let's go back to recall and into a quiet room so we can have a look at our new items. Here we go. Typing inventory, we can see that we actually have six of these items. One of them is level 22 and the other five are level 20. When an item loads up, it can be plus or minus two of the level it was set at. This is shown here in the variance of the levels that I've got. The level of the item on iwovr.org suggested it was level 18. Typing ID con, we can see that we get plus two dexterity and plus two hit roll. Typing ID 2.con, we can see that we also have the same stats, but it is a little bit lower in level. This item is also invisible, which may be the reason why it didn't show up on my list earlier. We can see that the item I've just replaced gave me plus one to wisdom and plus two to damage roll. Now I'm going to hang on to this Eye of Flame because when I remote, I'm going to want to be able to wear this again when I get back to level 1. I'm going to put the Eye into my Testament of the Watchman. This way I know it is safe. I'm also auctioning my level 22 Golden Eye Contact. I'm not really expecting anybody to buy it but you just never know. Having a look at it again, we can see that it is only worth 15 gold. 
even if someone bids the minimum 105 gold coins on it, I've already come out on top.